I love I love being near the water. I love being at the beach. It's like it's my jour just like that. Were you playing in water? No. He was, huh? Good. Oh my god, I'm so overexposed. Good evening. Welcome to another vlog. Um, I'm, I don't know why I'm whispering. <laughs> I have just packed at Sonda Studio. I am taking my first Pilates class. I'm super nervous. I don't know why. Um, but yeah, I'm just at the parking. My class is for 6.45. It's currently 6.17. It's just done 6.17. And it's very quiet. Maybe that's why I'm just whispering. Um, and yeah, today is Monday. Today is Monday. I'm having my first essentials class. So the beginner, if you're a first timer, you do the beginner class and then you do an essential class. So this is my first, like my first class ever. Um, we're really going to test the strength of my core, girl. You know. But yeah. Um, I am so nervous, but we're trying out new things. So I have my socks. They said for you to bring your own socks, your own sweat towel and bottle of water, which I really have. I've put ORS um, in my water because girl, I don't know how much sweating I'm going to do. So let's get in the class. I don't know if they'll allow me to film, but I'll go with my phone and see if there's somewhere I can place it. And then maybe we can experience this thing together. I will definitely let you know um how that goes okay well welcome to the vlog subscribe if you haven't and um yeah share if you care let go so guys this is how it looks like i like i like this focus on the good and this is how the class looks like. This is the reformer, this is the machine. I'm actually choosing this last one. No, I think I'll do this one so I can see myself. There I am. So this will be my machine. The packs of coming in early. A little, yeah, it looks just like this. Um, it's quite a big space. This space uh, does four. I've seen a space that does two and another two. So it feels really nice. Hi. the pilates class that was really good i actually it was just a beginner class so like they're teaching us um how to use the reformer machine but it was so good i could feel a bit of my glutes when i came home and a bit of my core which is what i really want to work on especially my core strength doing planks and all that is good but i just want to take it that you know that extra level and do like inner 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 muscle work but that was good i do have another class on monday a week from now because that was yesterday's monday and um uh the other class is monday so it's a week apart um and this time it's a morning class i hope i can record that for you i found a place maybe where i can put my phone if i go early enough i get a nice machine that's yeah anyway that was good um it was a bit late for me 
but there was no traffic that was the beauty the class started at 6 45 ended at 7 45 um, that was amazing now it's tuesday morning it is uh, maybe 10 to 7 i am packing for the beach literally i'm packing for the beach our flight is at 10 so check-in is at 9 35 i'm wearing my retainer check-in is at 9 35 so we need to be there by 9 so we're leaving here at 8 30 because i just don't want no jokes but i haven't packed so i don't even know what i'm going to the airport and it rained last night because october has just decided to rain so let me first of all get my suitcase and then we can even chat calvin all good you let the cut out yesterday when you went for your beach for your bucket and stuff he ran out do you know i waited for him until i don't know maybe 10 o'clock i know he was refusing to come in he was on the fence with that other gray cat so i told auntie not to let him out so okay So my battery died while I was packing, but I have finished packing and now I want to go make a cup of coffee and have a mini pastry. I'm not going to the gym or anything. Uh, it was too close for me to cut it. So I have packed. I literally just threw in everything, but I think I've covered all my bases. And then this is what I'm wearing today. Ignore the mess. No, this mess i'm wearing this bomber jacket this crop top which has served me so well my god and this skirt which is part of a two set i'll show you guys just before i head out and this bomber jacket and i've actually ordered another one from mango same style this one's from zara but i like the mango one it's more cropped and has like shoulder pads and the fragrance of the day which i will also carry to the beach is aqua de parma peonia nobile so let's go make a cup of coffee and have something to bite excuse hi where were you huh i heard he was wet were you playing in water he was huh Surely, surely, lemon. <laughs> okay, so outfit of the airport. I've also made a reel for this. Um, I have something in my face. <sighs> Lemon's fur. Sunglasses are Fendi. You know this ones, guys. Bomber is Zara. This little green top. We have literally worn her to death. But my God. How she served her her purpose so i'm wearing the green crop top also from zara the skirt was part of a set from h&m from like a year ago sneakers um adidas and the green at the back there kind of like it matches this green fragrance is aqua de palma peonia new bill she smells so lovely this morning and i'm all packed up and ready for the beach so let's talk when we're on the other side Reporting live from boom 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 boom. Say it, Calvin. Mama. Diani. That was so anticlimactic. <laughs> so we are in Diani. I'm so exposed. I'm gonna try and fix this. Yes, we just checked into our room. It's hot. Okay, it's 30 degrees of pure dry heat. Um, I'll do a little b-roll to show you the hotel it's beautiful we stayed here before covid 
um and we came back they they remembered us i'm so so happy i want to take a photo of this outfit at the lounge i think i like it's cute it's giving vacation and the best part of this staying here for us it's always the private pool it's always the private pool but it's so hot it looks just like that it's, it's beautiful it's unbelievable but wait if you have watched this far i would love for you guys to like and subscribe if you haven't already thank you you like and subscribe Calvin keeps telling like exactly Calvin. tell them right you must like and subscribe <laughs> you have to yes <laughs> he always tells me it's so much work um vlogging sorry tells me it's so much work vlogging mama they better like and subscribe he's so sweet um yeah so we are staying here and we have actually uh booked a reservation for dinner at the cave so that's where we're gonna go for dinner i'm not gonna like be filming a lot while on holiday because it is a little break and i do want to spend some quality time fam bam time um hi oh good that's the menu yes. and then i also want scissors. scissors yeah there's something i need to cut a zip tie as i look into this let me as i look into this you can bring okay thank you i want to get some bubbly i'm in a bubbly kind of mood my brother is coming over to say hi um, and I think this is where I'll leave you guys. I'll do a b-roll of the hotel and a bit of our room and um, Yeah, I love I love being near the water. I love being at the beach. It's like it's my jour and my skin immediately goes like oh, So good so 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 good
still cold? One liter. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, food. Is there any pasta option? Have the guns to protect ourselves. Thank you. Like that. I think it actually helps. Vacation o'clock. <gasps> so clever. Good morning. It is. I don't know. Do you want to change? Mm, I don't change six times in a day. You'll just change? Okay, you could wear shorts and a t shirt for breakfast. I want to check out that yoga studio and see if it's any good. Okay. Maybe I could do yoga very early tomorrow. Good morning, everyone. Cup of coffee in my hand. A nice espresso. It looks really good. My goodness. We had a great. Oh, you are playing a video game. Yeah. Oh, okay. We had a great night. Dinner at Alibaba's was so good. Um, we were so lucky to get a reservation last minute. Like we literally asked our reception to call them maybe at top thirty, and they had a, a booking. But that was really good. We had dinner. Uh, bumped into a friend of mine. Um, it was nice it was really nice and we were home and in bed by eight o'clock now that guys that's that's a that's a, that's a proper night out um but <laughs> i did my hair because i don't know if you guys saw i swam a lot but it had air dried by the time i came back home so all i did is i really oiled her up and then put her in like these two knot buns <laughs> i'm gonna take them out i'm not gonna swim this morning because i want my hair nice for lunch I want us to go to Sands at Nomads for lunch. My lips are so dry. I've just brushed my teeth and washed my face. I want us to go to Sands at Nomads for lunch. So I want to make that reservation right now. But I'm not going to swim and mess up my hair. Like, <coughs> unless I'm swimming like with my hair, my head out. Not dunking the whole thing. So, I want to peep the yoga studio. They said they have a yoga studio and an aerobic center up here. I just want to peep and see how it looks like. But we're on our way to breakfast because we're hungry. Uh, yes. we'll talk to you guys later the sun hasn't come out yet because yesterday my god I don't know it was the wrath of sun so right now it kind of looks like okay not so bad it's decent even weather like what you call it the feeling like when you put your arm out it's not burning um, yesterday was bad yesterday was bad so let's go have breakfast we'll talk to you guys later bye <laughs> looking <laughs> oh, looking like a hot mess but happy heart so today's the last day at the beach I'm so sorry I didn't film so much yesterday I did it on my phone so you're just gonna see the other clips but we went we swam most of the day and then went for lunch at uh, Nomads and that was fun uh we had pizza and carpaccio beef carpaccio and we went to the ocean that was good fun and then we just came back home watched a movie so i'm a little bit more i had a massage mm, it wasn't that good because i feel like i have a knot at the back of my um right shoulder but i had a massage and just had a very chilled uh evening we had dinner in our room and watched a movie and went to bed and so today is day three and we are i've just washed my face brushed my teeth uh we're going for breakfast and then we'll come shower change and go home uh, but it's been a nice little break um you don't know you need the break until you take the break so if you're thinking about taking a break this is your sign so that was fun 
I'm already packed up. Our flight is a morning one because we land in Arabia at around 11 and I have an, a hair appointment at 2 because my hair is it's, it's so dry and crispy because of the sun and the pool water. So I need a deep, deep treatment and probably I'll do some tracks. Um, yeah, and that's that. Okay. I'm back home, obviously, and I've done my hair. I'm just arranging some some stuff because I want to sit down and talk to you guys. Right. So I am back home, and I've just opened my curtains because I want like natural light to come in because it's. What time is it? I think it's like five or a few minutes after five. I have come back from the hairdressers. I got uh, my hair done. If you saw me earlier this morning, actually, if you saw me on the flight, I was looking a hot mess. Like my hair was just in a poof and I hadn't even combed it. So you're looking much better. This is track and sew because my hair is freshly relaxed. Um, this is track and sew and uh, I'm using an old bundle the bundle the hair that I wore while I was in Paris this is the same hair because you can see the highlights so I just took like one bundle from there and did all this anyway my whole room like when I walked in um, this afternoon smells like this fragrance like it smells so good this is a, a moash guidance and I'm carrying this with me because tomorrow morning we're going to Gilgil like literally landed today and tomorrow we're going to Gilgil for polo so I'm packing like I just unpacked and I hate unpacking I am packed I loaded the washer um, and went straight to the hairdresser and I've come back um, two packages have come I just want to quickly unbox them and share with you something I got like for almost 70% off and then um, pack again like literally put back my skincare stuff and my PJs and everything so it's wild we leave tomorrow morning um, we're going to uh, Gilgil Manyata Polo Club for Polo and tomorrow is a public holiday so it's going to be a good one there's a lot of activity happening at the club but yeah what a wild ride so I will leave a link uh, down below for my hair. This is geek hair. That's the only hair I wear. And um, yeah, so I got this. Oh, funny, they didn't come in a in a bag. So I got this from Flannels. In fact, let me try and do something because I'm really washed out. Let me ch change the settings. Oh, and I'm wearing my retainer. I see if that will help. I've changed the settings. I hope this is much better because I, I was looking very washed out and pale. But now I have some color to me. But anyway, I got this from Flannels. Flannels were running a 20% uh, sale, like 20% code, on, or even like on everything, even discounted items. And these shoes were already discounted like maybe 25 percent or like 15 percent and then i used the code and it went through and so i got these shoes these are by ysl i really realized i noticed i realized that i really like ysl and so i'm just gravitating to this brand more and more but anyway this is the box these are the shoes i went on youtube to try and find like sizing content and all that stuff and i did not get anything so this is how ridiculous this is these shoes were 460 pounds initially because they tell you the price i don't know if that's focusing the shoes are initially 460 pounds i got them ready drum roll for 193 pounds not gonna lie there we go what it's like the, the they're free honestly it's like girl math <laughs> but they were like too good to be true and so i couldn't pass off uh that that um deal so anyway they come in a box like this my other ysl shoes come in a box that, that, a different box that you can like literally pick up but anyway um 
yeah i went all over the internet to find sizing info about the shoes and i didn't find anything so i just decided to go upper size because they're canvas not leather so they won't really stretch so i really hope these shoes fit but i have them in a size 40 they look just like that and they came in one dust bag <clears throat> they came in one dust bag i think i sell always give me one dust bag and so they look just like that and they are espadrilles and they say saint laurent and saint laurent at the back as well it feels super super soft lots of stuffing and there we go so i went to this um app not app i went to this site i think it sucks at fifth or beard dogs i don't know but i went to a site that can convert shoe sizes for different brands so if you want to know what your size is for something like this i went and put in um saint laurent espadrilles canvas and then find my size then they then it like it, it's like a drop down it asks you what other shoes do you have so do you have interossi put your size or valentino put your size or chanel put your size so i did that and it said likely 40 is your size so let's see they say the truth currently fitting the shoe i'm wearing the left one i should have started with the right one. Oh, actually they are very roomy which is not a bad thing um because as, as i the one thing i'm not gonna do at my big age is wear uncomfortable shoes so uh, okay so this is how they're looking if only they will focus there we go so i got a size up i got a size 40 apart from my usual 39 and they fit actually like perfectly and it's 5 p.m so i've been walking around all day um and they fit there is a little bit of room you see very little I don't mind that because your foot swells especially if you're traveling and stuff like that your foot swells so i don't mind at all those are the espadrilles i i love them super comfy and the best part is i got them at such like a good deal so yeah actually i think i'll wear this tomorrow and this will be like the one pair of shoes i carry to gil gil okay so that's it for the flannel order I um they look like that just basic espadrilles I do have Chanel espadrilles super comfy I travel with those shoes best 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 uh, purchase honestly then uh, that was fun. and then I made an order at ASOS I am running the Standard Chartered Marathon and I needed a pair of running shoes and some like running accessories so I got a Nike t-shirt actually a lot of these things are from Nike I got a Nike t-shirt which I thought was cute and is it just me or the Nike store in Nairobi is really overpriced but I got a Nike tee. It's very, very light. So, like, breathable fabric. Love that. Um, this will also be good when I go to the gym and just wear, like, my sports bra. And um, I want something on top that's not really hot. This is really lightweight fabric. I like that. And then I got a pair of socks. This is a three pack. And I think it was, like, discounted. That's good. I got Nike leggings. I'm gonna put like a photo here of how these look like. Um, and I like this because they had the Nike and the swoosh right here. I thought these were cute. And these are the tight fit high rise full length. These are really nice. They feel really, really good quality. And then I also got another pair of bottoms also from nike actually everything is from nike and these are in this like gorgeous um green color i thought this were really nice 
and the length of them is actually something i like because they kind of get to your calf not not your knee and not your ankle so that just that nice um length they call it crop length um and i like this they also have a very big thick band love 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 i think i'm gonna wear this one for the marathon because it matches i also got a pair of shoes it matches my running shoes I know they're being washed off but let me just show you these are my nike runners they're called nike running so if you can see that here oh they look huge but i got my size i got 39 yeah you can six They look huge. I'm gonna try them on, but that's the other one. So I think if I wear these, and these are like my running bottoms with my Sancha tee. Okay, girl. And then once I'm done marathoning, I'll just change into my white night. Okay, girl. Let's try these on. <laughs> Let's try this on. They look so big. Is it just me or like sports shoes? Sports shoes are so huge. I look like I have huge feet. All right. <sighs> okay, once again, we are in the mirror. These fit so perfectly. There we go love 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 they have like the perfect cushion especially in my heel i like that i like that they're running shoes so obviously then from walking briskly um they'll be good yeah those are the nikes and i think that's everything so i think that's everything i i think that's everything i want to jump in the shower and like scrub my body from head to toe and like shower for like a good 20 25 minutes just foaming and i like i want to foam and switch off the shower and just scrub my whole body and then lotion my whole body wear some comfy pajamas order takeout and sit in front of the tv with my fam bam um we are sleeping early obviously because we, we have a road trip tomorrow um but yeah that like that's it for, for for this is it for it okay i think i'm not gonna vlog this weekend i'm really really tired i know i just came from holiday but i just don't want the, the headache of doing that instead i will talk to you guys when i'm going for my second class my second uh pilates class and hopefully i will be able to film um that class just to show you like a little bit and end the vlog there okay so thank you so much for watching up to this point if it's all over the place girl it's real life so see you on monday inshallah good morning and happy monday i am on my way out i'm going for morning pilates and so this is my outfit for pilates but i am going to shower and change there because i do have a meeting right afterwards so at capital club so i'll go there to like um afterwards when i'm just changed but this is um some of the gear i got from asos from nike this is the shirt love it inside i'm wearing a sports bra and then these are the leggings love these i love these even more than the lime ones and then the socks um i'll be getting more of this this kind of like leggings they fit like a glove like they're so good and they like hold your your bits like they're doing a good job i love them i love them i love them i love them and so that is me um i'll try and record 
just a little bit like a time lapse in the class i hope they allow me and um, and just maybe just show you how that goes and then this week i have book club so i have a book i need to finish uh book club is on thursday and then i have the marathon on sunday so i'm thinking to just like end the vlog here and then just leave you with like highlights for the rest of the week because i don't think i'll be picking up my camera um yeah and i think that's it guys thank you so much for hanging out with me i came back hi lemon he has been upset he's been upset because we let we left him alone we've been to the beach then we came back then we went to Gilgil. -Gil, so he's not happy with us that he's not seen us yes i'm so sorry he's just been growling he's been so mean sorry lemmy i'm sorry come come i'll fuzzy yes yeah, see and then he just throws himself down like this so you can pet him that has been my life since yesterday anyway yeah so i'm gonna leave you guys i'll talk to you in another video sending you so much love and light i'll make sure to link down everything that i've mentioned and i'll catch you in the next one all right bye